Oh yeah, it, 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 it's up now, bro. It's up now, bro. Hey, what's good, y'all? Welcome back to another video. Hey, if you new, make sure you leave a like, comment, share, subscribe, turn on your post notifications so you don't miss a video. Now, today, we have PowerBook 2 Season 4, Episode 9. This one is called To America the Game. Man, 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 man. I ain't gonna lie, the end is definitely near. And not even near, like, we're literally, like, after this, like, the show, like, well, this show is over. I'm pretty sure, like, Tariq and some of these characters that do make it out of here, I'm pretty sure they're gonna explore off into other spinoffs. You know what I'm saying? Cause I have been hearing, like, I have been hearing that like, you know, Tommy, I'm Tommy gonna have another show, and Tariq and Tommy gonna link up again. Possibilities of like, you know, Kane branching onto his own thing. Like it's like, so I like the fact that like, it, this would hit so different if this would have been like the final like spinoff. Like this was the final, the final spinoff of the of 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 the show, of the show of Power. I'd be kind of upset because it's like, dog, like, what kind of, like, what are we doing? Because we, we still have uh, two other other spinoffs like, after this. We got, well, that's still, like, currently, like, happening, which is Tommy Show and then Raising Kanan. Last episode, Noma and Carter teamed up. You know what I'm saying? So that that was, I, I didn't even expect that. Keep it to be, I didn't expect that. I really thought that, like, they was going to go the route with, like, oh, they was going to have Noma and Carter to, like, go at each other, but... I, I mean, to, to be fair, to be fair, Noma kind of had her reasons. Well, she had her reasons because cause Monet been really playing in her face for like the longest. She, she like she been playing her she been playing in her face for the longest probably since episode maybe, maybe five when they took her shipment. And then when they, and then when she told Carter about the about the, the, the meeting with the Russians and then and I, and I just Monet to read too. Yeah, but, but this episode I want to see what's gonna happen. I, I'm pretty sure this is the episode. Wedding because I'm married to the game, so I'm pretty sure like this, this is the wedding episode. Yeah, I just want to see what happens because this is the I think this is the first ever wedding in power history. So we haven't really seen no wedding in power history at all. Not gonna lie though, I would I like seeing wedding weddings and drug movies or drug shows. The, well, the one with uh, New, New Jack City that's probably like to my like to this day like my favorite wedding drug movie because that the way the way that the way that wedding got shot up bro was crazy. Yeah, man, I don't want to do too much talking, man, before it happens to this reaction. So if you guys do end up like on our reaction, please like the video. It helps out a lot. It gets me pushed across the YouTube algorithm. If you guys really want to get my channel out there growing and going, you have to like the video. It really does help out a lot. Comment down below what y'all want to see next. Hit that subscribe button, share the video and the channel as well, and hit that Patreon link below if you want to see the full reaction to this video, because I'm pretty sure it's going to be some stuff in here that, that I'm not going to they gonna put on here that I can't put on YouTube. You gotta hit that Patreon link below, man, if you wanna see everything, everything raw, unedited, uncut, all that shit. So, without further ado, let's get right into it. Previously on Ghost. Even if I were to pull a congressman out of a hat, the contract's contingent upon U.S. citizenship, which you... Oh, yeah, I need David to pick a side, bro. Like, honestly, you, like, said I should start you had this episode and next episode. Pick a side, bro. Why didn't you? I didn't know she was gonna wave the ring in your fucking face. Listen, she's just trying to make it seem like something that is Game. not. I need you to pick a side too, bro. We know your operation. Detective Carter is who we want. The reach is global, right? I, see, what I don't know. See, with Nico, I don't know, know what type of time he on. Because one minute he seemed like he know Carter's on some bullshit, but then the next minute it's like he's still going to be loyal to Carter. I don't know, bro. I wish I would have just, instead of, like, like why like why rush this shit, bro? Like I said, Mecca could have been, like, I, I would have kept Mecca alive, bro. Because Mecca seemed like he was very well, cal very calculated, bro. Add that shit up. I thought you stopped cussing after you got saved, Janet. Oh, she came back? Well, it has something to do with me. This wedding is the only reason Bronze and I came into town. Oh, it's fake, though. Uh, 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 it's fake. Not tell me y'all not going. Bonnet, that is your son, and that is your brother. You can miss me with the, the fact. See, she yes, see the fact coming, that she, right? you know she she doesn't know, bro. Man, please, y'all going to the wedding, bro? Up your final... Hey, hey, congratulations! But Thank what's gonna happen though? 
Is she gonna make it out alive to even time. get to do that? Probably not. Final exam. The fact that they even should still like they still gotta throw a fucking class scene in there just to let us know, hey, they're still in school. What the was wrong? She didn't study. <laughs> no, I'm, 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 I'm playing. I thought you was moving it with L. What are you doing here? Why are you such a fucking dick? Why are you such a simp? Damn. Damn. <laughs> that slid you out as you saw me. Listen, man, you dodged a fucking bullet, okay? You might not have seen it, but that was a fucking distraction for you, for me, for for everything. And right now, we, That's a fact. we gotta be more focused on that. Look, I got a rogue dealer operating out of an abandoned amusement park called Vicky's on Staten Island. I need you to go check him out. See? Way whereby you, you fit right in with your skinny jeans and they them bullshit. Stupid ass. <laughs> yeah, like I said. See, before before Tariq got involved got with that Felicia shit, he would he would have asked probably Drew fine. Damn. Or, 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 or Monet. Or anybody else. He wouldn't ask that nigga. He's talking about Tariq. What about Tariq? Word is Carter sent him on a run. All right, there's a new dealer on Staten Island not oh, playing by oh, Carter's rules. You know how that goes. Oh, I'm, I'm, yeah, we just wondering. Some oh, see, 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 not Drew. Drew not anything else. He finna put it together. At, at least he told him, so now he know. But now, see, now know, now he know Carter ain't really fucking with him like that. <laughs> you know, I'm glad our father couldn't make this trip. Okay, so this is okay, her brother for sure. Affirm his belief that Americans lack tact. Lack tact. Bro, Obi. Oh my God, mm. I wish Obi was still here, bro. Who's her father, though? To be married again. Have the Italians arrested anyone for Lombardi's murder? No. Not yet. Bro, they still... Um, they gonna find out about that, bro. They are gonna expose yes, that information. <laughs> ah, your new family? <laughs> what the hell are they doing here? Nigga, you think we wanted to come? <laughs> you said you wanted to come. Ah, that nigga. Nigga, you think you wanted to come? No, of course. Everyone's welcome. Come in, please. Yeah, imagine, La imagine if Lorenzo was still alive and during this during this time, bro. Like, imagine that, bro. He, this, none of this would be happening, bro. Oh. You know, I am helping Oh my God, they having a dinner scene, bro. And they got Diane at the table. Like, what, what's gonna happen, bro? I like your home, Ken. Thank you. Very <laughs> architectural. Well, 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 that's 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 the first cap because. <laughs> Technically, that's the first case. Well, I guess you forgot Drew. that I said you and your brother can live here until I sell it. No, oh, it's weird because you told me that you own the place. I guess that bar salary doesn't quite cut it. Huh? Bro, see? Bah. Well, that dive bar was built by my mother and late father from the ground up in Queens. Come on, it come has on now. a ton of character. Like you and your family. Mm. Okay. Mm. What do you do? Very impressed how she's been running her company. Her company. Actually, it's more of a family enterprise. Yes, come on, do. come on. Take your shit. <clears throat> Guess ain't all rainbows and roses after all. So what do you do? Now isn't the time to discuss business. Nah, let's talk about it. Nah, let's talk about it. You're right. So how did you and Ken meet? We don't need to go over that again. No, I mean, it's a rehearsal dinner. What else should we be talking? About? I mean, he asking the Except right questions. Dante Spears, <laughs> Mecca. Yes. Yes, uh, he works for your family's enterprise. Girl, what's going on? Oh, Crazy. Mark, we just one big happy family. Anya. The facts. Can you help me gather the plates, please. Don't we have the help for that? Anya. The help? Nah, bro. Uh, nah, I ain't gonna lie. Anya, Anya. Enjoy Anya, what you not finna do yes. is that. Bro, she said, don't we got the help for that? Bro, I'm surprised Diana ain't smacked the shit out of her after she said that. Man, and I know I don't say this often, but you're a good son, King. <laughs> you mean you never say that shit? Say that again. I need to hear that. Nah, yeah. You're right. I never said it. I never heard that shit. <sighs> Look, I know you taking it for your little bitch and all that, and I get it. But get this, King. Noma ain't the one. Then, I ain't gonna lie. That was, some, that was uh, a good well, scene. Wait, wait, is there any, like, raids I should know about, Drew? Are there any more buildings you and no one want to buy from underneath me? Grow the fuck up, I am grown, nigga. Maybe if you handle business like a man. Bro. There's an abandoned amusement park on Staten Island with a food stand filled with all types of Nah, Just setting these niggas... Bro, they just setting these niggas up, bro. 
Let's consider this an attempt to strengthen our newfound familial ties. But it's a clean slate. Cap. <laughs> Noma's out of here. Oh my, oh my God. Oh. Hey, I got slay. Hey, I said what I said, bro. Wait, look, wait, that little dirt? Bro. That's crazy. I ain't gonna lie, having your sister at your best party is it's, it's crazy. That's the biggest, I mean the biggest that, the, the fact that bro. Wait, who? Wait. Why you say on the family and get what you're you saying, but you never know when the feds is watching. Nigga, suck my dick. <laughs> <laughs> hey, look. I, I ain't gonna lie, it's crazy seeing Dirk in here considering that Jeremiah was in the um power force. Uh, holding up? Uh, uh, an art curator thinks that I might be talented enough for a fellowship. In Paris. Mm -hmm. Wow. <laughs> Since when? I was the power and feeling needed, appreciated. Yeah, but that nigga don't appreciate you, bro. Kane's new wife, he sent her out to Staten Island. Staten Island for what? They about to set up a failure, bro. Go, go help her, bro. Nah, nah, nah. Everything's copacetic. Same shit every time. It's not the same shit. There's some random Russian nigga saying Vadim's going to Staten Island. Oh my God! Oh yeah, she's done, bro. She's done. Bro, go save her, bro. Drew, something's off. Janice said no one sent Monet to Staten Island and now Vadim is there too. Then Carter's pushing me out. He sent Tariq to do a job on Staten Island. Ooh! Go save them! Well, I don't think Tariq going. He said he's not going. No, no, no. Monet, however, yeah. I ain't gonna lie. I, this is not the song for this scene, bro. Wow. Wow. Yeah. Yeah. Definitely. All of this is gonna cut out. Because you're getting married tomorrow, but you're fucking me tonight. Me marrying ah. Noma has nothing to do with you. That's crazy. All right, you wanna go to Stanford and build robots? Cool. Stanford. But I wanna be Bumpy Johnson. You know? Yeah, see. Me. And that's the thing right there, bro. She still want to be in the game. She don't want to be in the game no more, bro. And he knows that. And I, and I think he, he respects that. He he does. But it's like, all he knows is the game. He doesn't know anything else. So it's like, like without the game, what can Kane do for real? Not saying, he's not, smart, not saying he's not smart enough to do something else, but it's like, what can this man do outside the game? I'm about to be running the entire operation, both sides. You want it in the game? Not you in. So she's going to California. I wonder if... You know what I'm saying Tommy going he's going to go to California because remember he's supposed to go to California at the end of OG Power, but he never did. What the fuck are you doing here, Tariq? Carter said, "What the fuck you doing here?" Norma sent me. Oh my God! I've been waiting for this moment. That look on your face. I mean. It's your ooh. Ooh, damn. And then we heard that Carter sent your ass here. So you knew Carter was after me this whole time? Hell no. Nigga, he, you come after my spot. <laughs> nah, say he, he just found out, nigga. No man the fuck we gonna do now? The fuck if they think we dead, let's be dead. Hey, fuck it. fucking smart. Oh my God. Bro, wear some gloves, bro. I will say this: if 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 season four was supposed to be a part one and part two, part one should have just been Tariq versus the Tahadas. Tariq versus No Man the Tahadas. So it could have been it could have got ten episodes. That'd have been perfect. Then part two could have been ten another ten episodes where this shit right here. No, no, I'm no. fucking tired of those motherfuckers thinking they can stand against me. Okay. I'm Tariq. Say fucking Patrick. <laughs> <laughs> Dog. I killed my own fucking father. Mm. You shots. You shots your father. Breathe. I need an army. So you with me or what? Yes, if the writers would have did what they're supposed to do season four, you would have that. And if it weren't for y'all, I'd be dead right now. I can't repay you for that loyalty. Shit. Now, Tariq could be here any minute so we could figure this shit out. It's, it's funny because the beginning. I want y'all to stand with me. You would have been dead because of But you're grown. Now. 
It's so crazy. The 180 is crazy, bro. The 180 is so crazy, bro. It really is, bro. How you know Kane ain't working with no more? Mm. He's my son. That's how the fuck I know. You, so why isn't your fucking son here figuring this out with us? Okay, look. <laughs> that's I don't a... think Kane knew about no more. Just kill the bitch before she walks down the aisle. Damn. <laughs> and that's your legal advice. That's risky as fuck. Nah, really. <laughs> gonna be... Get him when he's doing confession at St. Michael's. He goes every Saturday at four. Yeah, I would love to see he's that. Always in the second. St. Michael's has tons of cameras. You gotta black them all out. If you can handle that. Where the fuck is your white boy and where the rest of the hands? I don't want him involved. All right? Yeah, yeah we can't well, Brady. You ain't got a fucking choice. We can't have Brady part of this. If he ain't gonna be down for this. Brady might, but if he ain't gonna wanna do that shit. Carter and Norman tried to take me and Monet out last night. So now it's a fucking war. Again? Yes, nigga. Happened at a church with a higher security system and a guard. I need the guard distracted and the system taken down. Why would I help you? Because Ushanji is ready to tell anyone that's fucking. Why would I help you? See, this is what I was talk. This, this is what this is what this is what I mean with Effie, bro. This is the shit I be talking about with Effie. You flip flopping ass bitch, bro. One minute, one minute, you down to help me. One like you telling me Kane here to kill me. You tell me all like, bro. You tell me all this shit. Then the next minute, it's like when I need you to help me. It's like, oh, why would I help you? Like that's what I'm talking about with Effie, bro. It's like, oh my god, it, it, it pisses me off. That's why this is why I say episode one should have he should have got knocked off. I don't care, bro. She should have got knocked. Hell, Kiki. I would have loved Kiki to not really take her spot, but take her role when it come to like, oh, hacking at computers and all that shit. Like, I would have loved for that to, like, to be Kiki's role. Because Kiki, I I was really invested in her character, bro. Like, they, bro, oh my God. Bro, like I said, episode one should have just knocked that shit off. I don't care. Everyone but Kane. This means you need to keep a secret from your little boyfriend. Okay, hey, nigga, you asked me for help. And if you want to go there, then we can go there. Because last time I checked, Lauren was still alive and you got a baby on the way. Nobody asked you to kill Lauren. If you didn't, bro, nah, bump that, bump that. Cause if you didn't do what you did, none of that would have happened. What are you talking about, bro? Again, you sound dumb. If you wouldn't have did what you did, none of that would have happened. I don't give a fuck. If you wouldn't have did what you did, Tariq already had a plan to get Lauren out of the city, bro. If you wouldn't have done what you did, none of that would have happened. I don't care. I don't give a no. All of that is your fault. Fuck out of here. Talk about Lauren was alive and you had a baby on the way. What the fuck? The baby was an accident, okay? Let, let's say that. But why do you think Tariq did any of that? Because of you, nigga. Fuck out of here. Sound dumb. Like, like bro, I'm going to say, that's why, I, that's why I say I don't, I, I, I fuck with Effie to a certain extent, but when you, but, but like when she say dumb shit like like that, bro, it's like, bro, you sound you sound stupid, bro. I don't care. Bro, he's a thug with a badge. What the fuck is new? It's the fucking badge part, Reek. We've done worse, guys. Have we? Have you? Have you? I was just gonna say, have y'all? Who have, has? Me as if what have y'all done? Just keep looking over here. Can't locate him, so she asked that you and I go check on him. What are you talking about? She got a call, so I should have a talk with her. Yeah, she's in a pissing mood. Man, <laughs> you want to end up like Obi? That's on you. Yeah, you don't want to end up like Obi, nigga. Even, 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 even kill this. Nah, no, Davis would kill this nigga. Fuck it. Davis! Davis! This nigga is trash! Davis, if you was gonna do it, you should have just shot the nigga, bro. Now you got now you got what? That's your first body on here? That we seen? I still would have shot the nigga, I don't care. Acting like they're the Obamas or some shit. They wish. You can't hear your phones either? Oh nah, I, I wouldn't even nah bro. If, like realistically, bro, if it's a wedding like that, I don't even wanna go, bro. I'm not saying like I have to be on my phone at the wedding, but if I like, you gotta confiscate, like you have to confiscate my phone, I can't. But I understand, but Manoma's reasons why. Like I said, at a real wedding, yeah, you're not taking my phone. I don't care. This nigga Davis, bro. We are gathered today. Amen. I was wondering if they're gonna be at the wedding or not. Oh shit, dog! Oh my god, bro! Come on. Right in. Brayden, Brayden. Oh shit, bro. Hey, yeah, let's go ahead and knock this nigga block off, man. You gotta do better than the punk ass rushes, my guy. Come on, get up, let's go. <laughs> oh my <laughs> god, bro. Bro, I thought he was just finna. See, Ghost wouldn't have done all of that, bro. Ghost would have popped that nigga right in the. 
Ghost would have popped that nigga right in the confessional and went on about his business, bro. What the fuck is this nigga to read? You know what? I guess that was the plan. The plan was to, she did say, Monet did say, bring him out to the back of the car and you won't see him again, whatever. Ghost wouldn't did all of that. Ghost would have popped that nigga right there and went on about his business. What? Like, take it for what, bro? You remember that one with Zion? Shut the fuck up. Man, he put an ass whooping on you boys that day, but hey, <laughs> yeah. you won the battle, right? I forgot to mention that, um, well, I got the whole thing on video, so you're fucked. Oh, oh my god, bro. Oh, oh, hell no, man. What the fuck, man? Stay right there. Right there. This nigga Tariq, bro. Should have just sh see, bro. Say, Ghost would have popped him right there, bro. In the confessional, bro. Tariq and Monet are alive. Expect company. You know what? Forget I said anything. I'm, I'm just tight right now, bro. Cause this nigga Tariq is a dumbass, bro. Should have just popped him right there, bro. You had the perfect opportunity, bro. Use your common sense. I don't think he's involved. But if I find out otherwise, he'll be handled. He's not. In he's not involved. This is very untoward. Chastise me later. Untoward. Right now, I need your support. Can you do that? Of course. The thing is, he's not involved, but... <laughs> yeah, bro. No. Bro, I, I love it when Nigerians do that shit, man. Come on. Come on, bro. Think of something. Think of something, dog. Ooh! He, ooh no, he gotta be dead, bro. He gotta be dead. If he lived through that, depending on how long it is, but still. What the fuck, Raiden? What the fuck? Hey, man, he had to do it. That's what shit Tommy would have done. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie. Yeah. Oh. Bro. I, I forgot they do, they do throw money at, at, at Nigerian weddings. Oh. Um. Bro, that's crazy. So Lil Durk is his cousin, okay. Hey, what the fuck did we just do? I don't know this motherfucker had us on tape. Hey, we need a fucking plan. Yeah, I gotta get it from him too, that's the crazy part. My team doesn't hear from me. NYPD burns the city down searching for me, so. Really? Mm. They care that much about you? Hell no! Fuck you looking at, bitch. <laughs> yeah. Bro, what's going on, bro? Ooh! Please tell me Monet did that. Y'all gotta get the fuck out of here right now. No, we're not letting you go in there by yourself. We got a fucking army in there. Look, listen to me, God No, damn it. Ma, you listen to us. We're going in with you. Tadis first. Fuck it, bro. Let him we'll go. Yeah. Back. You take the fuck hey, out. Hey, bro, come on. Exactly. Like, you can't, you can't go by yourself, man. Ooh, that's a perfect... That's a... That's a perfect song to do this to. Damn. Ooh, run quick C. You know you need me, right? Without me. Government contracts don't work. Which is why we're having this conversation. I ain't gonna lie. I ain't gonna lie. She going off right now. Growing up the way I did, a black kid in these streets is fucking treacherous. That's a fact. But you said I do, but really you don't. Fuck you! Fuck you! Fuck yourself, you cunt. <laughs> Ooh, come on! Chose you, Monet, so you can fucking die. Shoot him. Wait, what's gonna happen? Come on. No, no, chill out. Chill, chill. No, chill out. No, no. Bro. Okay, okay. Ma. 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 Bro. 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 Oh yeah, it, it, it's up now, bro. It's up now, bro. It's so crazy because that's what they wanted last season. They was trying to knock her off, but it's like I know the circumstances have changed, so it's it's crazy. I'm trying to hold it in, bro. <laughs> like, I'm, I'm really trying to. I'm really trying to hold it in right now. Like I'm, I'm really am, bro. I'm trying to hold it in, cause dude, like, 
the first couple shots, I feel like she would have walked away off that. But nah, then the shots up here, and like, nah, bro. You kill me, your life is over. Monet is dead because of you! Davis, we're fucked. Oh, shit. We decide bro, what you're thinking, dude. How you gonna get out of this one, brother? Nigga, it's old, bro. I ain't gonna lie now. I gotta watch that again. Nigga, oh my god. Bro, that was great. But no, bro, that's crazy, bro. That's crazy. I, bro, like, that's crazy. I can't believe it, bro. Like, like I had a feeling Monet, part of me had a feeling Monet was gonna get dropped off this season. But not like, I thought she was gonna get dropped off episode like the last episode, episode ten. Yo, that's crazy, bro. <laughs> oh my god, that's crazy, bro. That's but nah, but hey, I gotta give it to Monet. She went out like a G. I gotta give it to her. Monet went out like a G. Ain't like they just up and killed her, like, and she was like defenseless. Like no, she went in that bitch went out guns blazing. I, I fuck with that. I, hey, Mary J. Blige, man, you did you did your big one with this show. I remember the first episode, man. Like, I, I, like she, she gonna be definitely like one, one of my favorite characters. Even though Monet hasn't been the best of a mom, in the end she always come through. You know what I'm saying? She came through. So even, even, even if like she had to like lose her life to do. Kane, by Kane is, I, but I like that Kane. I, I like, I like this. I ain't gonna lie, Kane. I like I, the, my favorite scenes with Kane was the, was how he like he defended his mom to Noma, and then the one where him and you know, him and, him and Monet was talking, and it, and it was like the scene that they, the, the conversation they had at the, at the penthouse in his office. I ain't gonna lie, now Tariq, I'm gonna need, I need, I'm gonna need. At this point, I'm not expecting no big cameo surprises to show up. I'm, I'm gonna go on record and say I don't expect Ghost to show up anymore, you know. But I don't, I'm not gonna go out and, and believe Ghost is dead. I don't believe. It. I to this day, I still don't believe Ghost is dead. But I will believe. I, I can't say I don't expect. Him to show up again. I will say, had he show, had he shown up in the last season, the last, uh, the last episode of season three, instead of like, if he would have helped, came in and helped him instead of Braden, that'd have been hard. Effie, again, I ain't like what Effie says to Tariq talking about. So why would I help you? And then, oh, the last time I checked, Warren was alive, and you had a baby on the way. I'm like, yeah, but all of that stemmed back from you trying to kill Warren. Think about it. Not a big, again, the baby wasn't planned, but it can, all of that stemmed back from trying to kill Warren. Fuck out of here. You sound dumb, <laughs> but. Nah, that this nigga Brady dog. It's Braden, I ain't gonna lie, bro. Braden this season, bro. It's like it's like what are we even doing here anymore, bro? I don't even know. It's like it's like it's like each episode Braden feels less less away from the show. Like like part from, like it's like he doesn't feel like he's part of the show anymore. It's like he's just like he's there when he's needed. Season three, this nigga was like very involved. It's like this season he's not that involved. Maybe like the first half, or like the first couple, couple episodes he was, but it's like now it's like he's just, I ain't like this nigga Carter, bro. Talking about some like, oh, if they don't hear from me, like in, in, at, at, at this X amount of time, they finna burn the whole New York City down looking for me. Like, do the, do NYPD love you that much, bro? Do they love you that much, or is it, or, or is it just Nico? By the way, Nico gotta go too, because at this point, he gonna always, it's like he gonna always be loyal, loyal to Carter, no matter what, even if Carter's on. On some bullshit, he's still gonna be loyal to Carter. I thought Nico would have seen through Carter's bullshit after after that whole Kamal Tate situation, but this nigga still like this nigga still stay loyal. Yeah, it was a good job, future retro here. Side note, real quick, I would have loved to see Dirk get in the shootout with the um at the wedding, cause that would have that would have been nice. That'd have been real nice. I, I, I forgot to mention that, but other than that, that's all I gotta say. I don't know how to feel right now. But yeah, this is gonna end this reaction. So if you guys did like my reaction, please like the video. It helps out a lot. Comment down below what y'all want to see next. Hit that subscribe button. Share the video and the channel as well. Hit that Patreon link below if y'all want to see the full reaction to this video. You gonna have to, cause it was some stuff in here that you did. You know what I'm saying? That I couldn't put on here. So you gonna have to. Uh. Till next time. Stay lit.